this is the end of January grocery haul. Um, I got quite a lot of things. I'm still on my transition from eating all the junk at Christmas to trying to getting back to eating healthier, eating a bit more of the Trim Healthy Mama way, uh, cutting the sugar from my diet, and all those good things. So you won't see a whole lot of junk, but hopefully a lot of really healthy food. So let's get started and I'll show you what I picked up from Kroger. Oh, and I wanted to mention that I've had a couple of you say that they that you were able to find some things that I was looking for at Walmart. But just as a reminder, I am no longer shopping at Walmart. Um, they were incredibly rude to my family. The, the associates at the Walmart where we shop, they were incredibly rude to my family right before um, Thanksgiving or after Thanksgiving, it was between Thanksgiving and Christmas, I can't remember exactly the date. Um, and so because of that reason, I am no longer shopping at Walmart. So just, just to let you know that. So here is what I picked up from Kroger. And on that note of not shopping at Walmart anymore, I just wanted to add that uh, my husband specifically was afraid that we'd end up spending a ton more money not shopping at Walmart. And to be completely honest with you, I have not noticed any difference in my budget at all. So it's kind of a myth that you can shop at Walmart to save money. If you're careful and watch what you're doing, you can save money wherever you shop. So let's get on with this grocery haul. Um, this was a little bit strange. I ordered two loaves of this organic um, 22 grain seedless or seeds grains and seeds, brown berry bread, and they gave me one regular loaf and one thin sliced. No idea why, but that's okay. <laughs> my husband doesn't really like the thin sliced, so I guess that'll be my bread and he can have that. I got three of the honey wheat for uh, Travis and Olivia. Olivia really, really liked the Kroger plain bagels that I got the last time. And so I got two bags of those this time. I got some of these sprouted grain wraps. These are going to be for me to use for whenever we have tacos or if I want a quesadilla or whatever. I will be using these sprouted grain ones. I got another thing of chips for Travis's lunch and Mountain Dew. He pays for those. He likes to take those in his lunch. If I had my way, he wouldn't take that junk, but he buys it. So, and he's an adult. I can't tell him what to do anymore. So there we go. Um, this is weird. I ordered four of these Wee yogurts, and they notify you. They give you send you text messages um, if they have to substitute something, and they asked if it was okay to substitute this, and I said sure. I thought I was going to be getting four of these, um, but apparently they only had three. So they just substituted one. So this is something I've never used before or never tried before. So it'll be interesting. I've heard Chobani is a good brand. So it'll be interesting to try that. I know Olivia is going to want the two Wii's. Two, two of these are for me and two of them are for Olivia. And she's going to want two of the Wii's because she loves that yogurt. I got some more creamy peanut butter. This is to put in our food storage room. Uh, some cornmeal. I went to make cornbread the other day and realized I did not have any cornmeal. So I had to remedy that. Ordered some cornmeal. I got two packages of cheddar style uh, dairy free shredded cheese. One thing of cream cheese. Ollie needs to go outside and go potty. Hold on a minute. Okay, Olivia's going to take him out. Um, I need to or I need to order more of this the next time because there he is scratching at the door again. Hold on, she'll come out just a minute. Be patient. Be patient, little boy. Olivia <laughs> doesn't want to take him out. We have discovered. Well, I think I've shared with you that uh, Ollie is an escape artist. He has escaped our backyard fence like four times. We were going to put up an electric fence, and then we decided or we figured out that it was not going to work for our property. So we aren't sure what we're going to do, but in the meantime, he can't go out unassisted. We put him on the leash to take him out to go potty. It's kind of a pain, but it keeps him from running away. 
and we let Sally go out at the same time too because now she can't come and go as she pleases because we have the doggy door shut. But he is 100% housebroken. He hasn't had an accident in a long, long time and he'll either ring the bell, we have these jingle bells here for him, or he'll scratch at the doggy door and sometimes he does both if he really needs to go. Do you really need to go, Molly? Do you need to go outside and go potty? Do you? Do you? She's getting ready. She's got to get her boots on. She's got to get her boots on. All right. Don't know where I was. Anyway, I think I was saying I need to get more of this at my on my next haul because Travis's birthday is coming up and he requested a cheesecake. So in order for the whole family to have it, I make it with the dairy-free cream cheese. Anyway, that's in a grocery haul to come. Um, the last grocery haul, we tried this and it was really, really good. Everybody liked it, even the guys, and they don't have to be dairy-free. They really liked it, so I got two this time. Got some more of the chow cheese slices. Some of my dairy-free um, coffee creamer. I've not been drinking as much coffee lately because I go through seasons where my stomach is just tied in knots all the time. I haven't been able to do as much coffee um, so I've been drinking coffee about once a week and the rest of the time I've been drinking tea So I didn't have to buy as much creamer this time. I got two things of baking soda One is for for my baking this the Arm & Hammer and then this Kroger brand I'm gonna just open it up and put it in the refrigerator to absorb bad odors. I picked up some whole wheat spaghetti and rotini and penne. I just got the whole wheat kind this time Got some mini chocolate chips and some semi-sweet chocolate chips for baking. I got a lot of produce again. Like I said, I'm trying to eat healthier. So I got some more of those Halos or Clementines or Cuties or however you want to call them. They were really good in the last time. So I got some more of those. I got some more organic pink lady apples. Uh, I got some celery and some carrots. Organic carrots. I ordered organic celery. They didn't have it, so they... Um, replaced it with just regular. I got two heads of organic lettuce. I've been really enjoying salads. And so I got some iceberg lettuce. I got some organic grapes. Not a very big bag, but that's okay. Okay, on down the road here, I got some uh, mini pepperonis. Olivia likes those. I got some Miracle Whip for the cabinet two cans of beefy mushroom soup, some of this Simply Fruit spread, strawberry, and what did I get? Blackberry. I got some more chow mein noodles. Sorry for the glare, there's a lot of sun coming through the windows. I got some of these softies, Blue Dog Bakery dog cookies for uh, Ollie and Sally. Uh, I got two boxes of this Annie's Vegan Mac mac and cheese, two boxes of stovetop stuffing, uh, chicken flavor. Got some more of this coconut water. This is really good for stomachs, if you're having stomach issues. I got some more Welch's grape juice. Got some prune juice for Scott. Two bottles of hydrogen peroxide. I use this in the water when I clean my produce. Got two boxes of this pearled couscous. I got two boxes of this last time, and so I got two boxes again this time. I got two bags of these Arm & Hammer. These are actually laundry pods. Never used this kind before, but I thought I'd give those a try. I got some Nature Valley granola bars. This is for Scott with the chocolate on there. And then I got these for me for my lunchbox. At work sometimes in the afternoon I get really hungry, so those kind of hit the spot. I got another five pound bag of flour, some more popcorn. These were a replacement. I had ordered the Tyson chicken strips for our dinner tonight. They didn't have it, so they replaced it with the Kroger brand. Thankfully, there's no milk in them. I was worried about that, but I couldn't check it online when they because you have to approve this, the substitutions, and I couldn't check it. And so I'm like, oh, I just hope, I hope there's no milk, and there's not. So if we like these, and I will probably switch to these because I'm sure they're cheaper than the Tyson. 
I've got two, back, two bags of these turkey meatballs. We had these at New Year's and they were delicious. I really liked them. Got some frozen grape juice, concentrate. Got some of these Ezekiel sprouted grain English muffins for breakfast for me. Got some shoestring uh, french fries. These are to go with the chicken strips with our dinner tonight. Oh, uh, did I talk about this? I don't think I did. This is a big old thing of Coffee Mate for Travis and Scott for their coffee. And I think, I think that's everything. I don't think I forgot anything. So I will get this stuff put away and I'll show you what I picked up from Aldi. This is everything I picked up from Aldi and I see only one mistake that they made. And that's with this seltzer water. I ordered three of each flavor and they only gave me two of the grapefruit so I'm gonna have to check and make sure I didn't get charged for three but if they did they're really good about um, refunding money so I'm not worried about it and I'm sure we have plenty to last but anyway that's for Scott and Olivia has been drinking it as well I got two bags of the tortilla strips three loaves of the sprouted grain bread this freezes really well so that's what we'll do we'll stick it in the freezer two things of everything bagels for travis two packages of whole wheat tortillas two of these free drop freeze dried mangoes i really like these and they make a nice treat when i'm wanting something crunchy or if i'm wanting something sweet it kind of fits both of those categories and it's healthy and um, the only ingredient is the only ingredient is mango, so there's no added sugar or anything. I got some organic ketchup, two packages or two bottles of my favorite organic tomato and basil pasta sauce, two packages of oyster crackers, five cans of canned chicken we've been using some of the canned chicken down in my food room for different things so this is to replace that a thing of uh, cooking spray olive oil cooking spray two bunches of organic bananas some organic avocados three dozen organic eggs some grapefruit two boxes of organic mac and cheese for travis the regular and the shells. An assortment of this thin meat, sandwich meat for sandwiches. Uh, assortment of regular cheeses for Scott and Travis. Uh, these Colby and Jack cheese sticks and then the mozzarella cheese, like string cheese. Some cheese slices, American. Pound of butter and some Colby Jack, as well as some regular sour cream and Parmesan cheese. <laughs> so we were stocking up on our regular dairy items. Half a gallon of almond milk, unsweetened, original. Two things of half and half for Scott's coffee. Another thing of vanilla uh, coffee creamer for Travis's coffee. Four pounds of frozen ground turkey. Two bags of frozen broccoli florets. Um, on this side of the table, we also have some canola oil and some tomatoes, the vine ripened tomatoes. Then my paper products and cleaning products, I got some of these tall kitchen bags. This fits the trash can in, in my office. It doesn't fit our big kitchen uh, trash can, but this fits the one downstairs. I got some more sandwich bags. We've been going through a lot of those. Some toilet paper two packs of paper towels. This is something new. I've not ever tried before, but I wanted to give it a try. It's for the bathroom and it's got bleach in it. I like to use bleach cleaners in the bathroom. Some paper uh, napkins. Some of these wet mopping cloths for my um, Swiffer. It's not the Swiffer brand, but that's okay and it's um, lavender scented so I wanted to give those a try and then two rising crust frozen pepperoni pizzas for Travis 
All right, that's it. That's all I got from Aldi. All right, friends, that is my end of January grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks so much for watching, and we will talk to you later. Bye-bye, friends.